What's up guys, welcome to the video. Today we're talking about a major mode workout that's gonna go right along with that major scale workout you've probably already seen here on YouTube. Uh, and it's gonna take your flexibility in any key uh, to the next level for your jazz improvisation or just for your general musicianship. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do it in the key of F. What we're first gonna do is play uh, the, that scale, the range of the instrument. So we're gonna do it in the key of F, so I'm gonna start on low E. Now the next thing that we're going to do with that is starting on that low E, we're going to do one octave ascending uh, and going up all the modes diatonically. So it'll sound like this. So things to think about are making sure that you are jumping to the right scale. You're getting each one on the way up, each one on the way down, and thinking about alternate positions because eventually we want to be able to do this at faster tempos. Right now we're just getting it under our slide, but eventually we want to be able to go and have the freedom to be able to play that at any time during a solo. And just to have that freedom and flexibility to be able to play that uh, requires us to go slowly through each of these kind of things. So the next thing we're going to do is continue with that one octave, but instead of going up and up and up, we're going to switch directions. So we're going to start still on that low E, we're going to go up E, low green, and then we're going to go down F major, up G, Dorian, down uh, A, Phrygian, etc, etc, etc. So we'll keep this slow so you can follow along and play along. So it's like this. And then the last thing we're going to do that's the trickiest thing because we're going across registers here is we're going to do two octaves uh, in 16th notes. We're going to jump from the up register back to the low register. So we're connecting the low to the high and then on the way back down we're connecting the high to the low. So this is also a technique exercise as well as working out our brain and our knowledge of this key center. <laughs> Thank you. 
So there are four ways to practice your modes. We played it slow. We did one octave, one direction, one octave, alternating directions, two octaves covering the register. And uh, keep it slow, keep it exact, be really meticulous about it. And then when you get comfortable, you can go ahead and speed it up so that you can be playing through the registers freely when you're playing and soloing over in a tune. If you want to download the PDF of this workout, it's down in the description below. Thanks for being here. I'd love to see you guys playing this, so leave a link to your videos where you're playing this either on Facebook, Instagram, or YouTube, wherever you want to post your video. I'd love to see you guys working on this workout. So this is the key of F, only 11 more keys to go. We'll see you back here real soon for another video.